Mason, are you ready for your new school? Yes, Mom. I'm going to miss you. Heading for the bus now, Mom. At school. Hi, are you the new student? Yes. I'm your teacher, Mrs. Chan. And you must be Mason. Yes. Your class will start in half an hour. Where is my classroom? Because I don't want to be late. Let's take a selfie! Whoa! Who are you and why are you? I'm Ruby! I have a social media account called Ruby Pinky Girl. Nice to meet you. I'm Mason. I'm in your class this year. Oh, here are the others in our class. Over there is Matt. Luckily, you're a boy because he's dated every girl in this school. And he's the most romantic person I've ever met. Want to date me again? I'm not. I'm just telling Mason about you now. Go away. That was awkward. Who is that girl behind you? Hi, Rebecca. Hi, Ruby. I'm playing Among Us before class starts. She's a gamer girl. Flashbacks. That's Mariana. She's the rocker girl. She's the only student with dyed hair. Well, only her tip. And those two are Caitlin and Claire. Caitlin is a tomboy, but not as tough as Claire. They are Grace and Thomas, the Goths. You're reading tales of werewolves. The dark angels then trap them with a spell. Blake is the smartest in the class. He always gets A's in his exams. That's Gemma, the prankster of the class clown. One time, she dropped a bomb bomb in one of the girls' toilets. That's Kelsey, the cute girl. She tries her best to get a boyfriend, but she always fails. That's Maya. She's a fashionista, and she wears different outfits every day. She's one of our best friends. I post her pictures of her in her clothes on my social media account. And the worst ones of all. Alex and his friends Jake and Felix. They are the meanest people of all. One time, Alex called Maya a spoiler brat on social media. Another time, they ripped up Blake's homework. And another time, they ruined my live stream. Where is Rebecca? She's gone to class. Well, we better head to class now. In class, just in time, Ruby. Everyone, today we have a new pupil in our class today. Meet Mason, everyone. Mason, you can sit in the front. Now, everyone, we're doing a spelling test. After class. Hey. Hey, Alec. Wanna sit with me, Jake and Felix? Why not? What was your childhood like? Like most normal kids, you had a boring childhood. Me, Felix, and Jake had better childhoods. Why did I have to know? Forget it. I had barbecues every day. How are you not fat? This is going to be a secret. I worked out after every meal for five hours. Wow. Tell them your childhoods. I went shopping for whatever I want four days a week. I had a party every month. I wish I had a childhood as, as cool as yours. Let's go to a restaurant after school. And after that, we'll go shop. Okay, if my mom is okay with that. Can I have your number? Okay. At lunch? So, what did you do at the weekend? Me, Jake, and Felix went to a concert. I went to the library and got a new book. Seriously, books are for losers. I love sushi. The school's food is tasty. School food is for poor people. We pack our own lunch. Now that you mention it, I like my mom's lunches. Can't you bring your own lunch tomorrow? Mason, what are you doing? Did he tell you to come here, Pinky? After school? Yes, I have. Oh, hi, Mason. Hi, Bob. I want to ask you something. Can I go out with my new friends? Well, I was going to ask you if you wanted to go and see the new movie. Nah, I find the movie boring. Okay.
after buffet. So, what food does this buffet have? Basically everything you can imagine. Let's get inside. This food looks good. Thanks for serving our food. I don't mind serving others. I want to be a waiter when I grow up. This cherry pie is disgusting. Watch this, boys. Go and get some food, Mason, and throw it at that table. Okay? Not my homework! Ugh, my guitar's wet! No! That was mean of us. Mean, mean, who cares? <laughs> at the mall. What should we buy? There's a new phone on sale. I broke the phone my mom got me because it was released four years ago. I'll buy some expensive new clothes. What do you want to buy? Well, I always wanted this new music album, but it's so much money. Who cares about prices these days? Take some of my money. I'm buying a new video game. The next day, they spilled a drink all over my homework. I can't believe Mason joined the mean one. Never in my life have I been so betrayed. I bet Mason will cut my hair. Hi guys. You betrayed us! You'll never be your friend. Why does Grace and Thomas read books? They should be watching movies. Something wrong, Mason? I need some time alone, guys. Okay, let us know when you're ready to talk about it. What's wrong, Mason? I don't want to talk about it. You can tell me anything. Can you tell my mom this situation? Please tell me first. Okay, so Alex, Jake, and Felix came up to me and told me to be their friend. What's the problem with that? They took me to a buffet and they told me to throw food at people. Hello, Mrs. Briggs. Mason is forced to do mean things by his friends. Okay, bye. Mason, you're going to be in the class during break, so will Alex, Jake, and Felix. Thanks, miss. Later. Boys, is it true you forced Mason to do things he doesn't want to do? Of course not. Don't you dare lie! I'm so disappointed in you. He'll pay for this the next day. Don't listen to them, Mason. Okay, thanks, Mom. Bye, Mom. You're dead for betraying us. Who cares? At least I'm not adopted. How dare you! I think he's going too far. Are you going to betray me too? I'm telling your mom because we're BFFs back in school. So? That's the story. What happened to Alex? I don't know.